Okay, so in solving this problem, what we need to do is we need to multiply the first term, x to the one-third of the first parentheses, times every term in the second parentheses. So x to the one-third times x to the two-thirds, times x to the one-third y to the one-third, times y to the two-thirds. So that's going to give me x to the one-third times x to the two-thirds, which actually just equals x, uh, which actually just equals x to the first power, because one-third plus two-thirds equals one. Now, so that's our first term, so we can either just leave it as x or x to the first. So then we're going to have x to the one-third times x to the one-third y to the one-third. So x to the one-third times x to the one-third, we'll add the exponents. One-third plus one-third is just two-thirds. And then there's y to the one-third. And then you do x to the one-third times y to the two-thirds, well they have nothing in common, one's an x, one's a y, so we just write it down as x to the one-third, y to the two-thirds, they could not be added together. Now we multiply y to the one-third times x to the two-thirds, so that's going to give me, and I'm going to go ahead and order this in alphabetical order, so x to the two-thirds, y to the one-third, and then y to the one-third times a negative uh, x to the one-third, y to the one-third, We'll add the y's up, so it's going to be minus x to the one-third. That doesn't change, and then one-third plus one-third is two-thirds on the y's. And then finally, y to the one-third times y to the two-thirds just equals y to the first, like we did in the first term. So now we look for what are called like terms, which means they have to have the same variables and the same exponents. So in this case, x to the two-thirds, y to the one-third. If you notice, here's an x to the two-thirds, y to the one-third. What's also interesting is they both have the same coefficient, the number out front, which is one. But one's negative and one's positive, so they cancel out. Those are gone, zero. Same thing happens here, x to the one-third, y to the two-thirds, negative x to the one-third, y to the two-thirds. Those cancel out, and so your final answer is x plus y.